Thanks for coming back. Have you guys subscribed to my channel? If you haven't, please go ahead and subscribe. Anyway, let's talk about the discussion we had the other day about credit for businesses. By the way, how we? So, business credit is a little bit uh, kind of a not the same way as a regular credit works. I actually don't believe in uh, credit uh, because credit is going to put you in, it gives you some lead way, but at the same time, if something goes wrong, you're in trouble. And that trouble could be costly. So, most of the stuff, I mean, you should do, try to do it as a cash basis. Not that you go to the bank and pick up cash, like cash, cash. Just do it as a cash basis. So, try to make a deal with your client. Uh, get like 20%, 25%, 50% deposit. And then pay for your material, your cost, all of those things. And then after you collect the rest of them from the client in 30 days or 45 or 60 days, depends on the client, depends on the situation, depends on lots of variation. Like I, my business, every client has their own policy, basically. I don't have one policy for everybody. I have different client, different policy. I have client that I cannot collect uh, deposit like I work with big corporation but those big corporations are pretty much solid money when it's a uh, 45 days or 65 days or 75 days terms which longest one is actually 75 days I mean you know for sure you're gonna get paid so I have to be able to handle that uh, I mean I try to do it in a different way I basically all my material i i hustle in a different way i try to buy everything up front pay and get a discount because i believe in business you don't only make money of selling you make money when you are buying what i mean of that and i still forgot about this uh thing which is I don't know if it's gonna work or not, but let's see. Yeah, it works. No, it's better. I have a better sound. Uh, I'm a pretty, I have a big, pretty high wall call, but I don't even need <laughs> this thing. But it works. It works better. This way is better. So, just to let you guys know. I mean, that's the way I do it. So try, if you are starting a business, really try to boil down how you want to buy the material, your raw material, all of those things. Make money upfront from purchasing. So you make a deal with your vendor and you know you get a, you get a discount. I, like, I make deals with all my vendors that when I'm buying, you know, or I'm gonna pay you upfront. And it's not, it's not means, it doesn't mean that I'm going to pay them by cash, like a green cash. I just, uh, mainly I write them a check or a credit card. They want credit card and uh, I pay by credit card, which I don't like it, but I have no choice in some cases, you know. So that's the one thing that is really crucial in business. Uh, buy the stuff in the beginning with a discount so you can make money when you are selling it. Don't think that you're gonna sell more and make money. So if you get a discounted price, you know, uh, make a deal, you know, always. You're gonna be able to make a deal with everybody. There's always a deal with everybody. I mean, you can make deals with just anybody you can make a deal with that crocodile out there you can make a deal with that uh chicken out there you can make a deal with a monkey you know just make the deal make the deal 
buy it in a discounter and then try to kind of collect some deposit you know some customers are going to give you the deposit some they don't and after that you know uh, work out a deal with your customer that was buying how they're going to pay but you really have to uh, read their mind you need to have a psychology of your customers too you need to know who your customers are you need to know their behavior I mean there are people that literally they're gonna pay you but they're gonna just drag you and drive you crazy because and one thing I notice in the business like I mean we had it in the past too so when you call let's say you did a job and you delivered it and at the time comes in to collect money you haven't got paid when you call lots of these people I mean 60 70 percent of them first of all they ignore you uh, if they don't ignore you they don't even I mean they don't even answer they literally they don't answer and some of them that they they do answer they get to be pissed off at you I and mean, there's nothing wrong to call you gotta call like I had a big company you know and this uh, person wasn't responding to us uh, I end up uh, writing an email to someone else in the company and immediately I get a call well you can't do that I said well lady you know what this was a $26,000 job and it's a uh, 75 days we need to collect the money and your term with us is 30 days. Forget about 30 days, we let you go 60 days, but now we can't go longer than that. You know, oh, well, we are not gonna do business anymore with you. I said, well, that's fine with me. It's your choice to do business with me, and it's my choice to do business with you. It's not a mandatory thing here. Uh, I don't wanna go too, too far, but anybody has any idea, any comment, please comment below and uh, Please comment below and ask me a question. I'll be more than happy to answer. And subscribe if you haven't subscribed. And don't forget, I'm putting a video every night, no matter what. Whatever happens, I put a video out there. So, and uh, the topics are different every night. Uh, I'm, I have some stories that I'm gonna keep going with that but that's going to be a long time so i hope to see you guys soon and make sure hit the like button and have a great night in